to say. What a surprise this is. The toast of the coast. Hollywood, California. Hollywood, John Tatum. Hey, what I've done is brought a couple of my Texas girls here today. Hollywood, John Tatum's like a magnet. The girls come from all over the world. Look at them staring at me right now. Look at them. Hold them back. Give those girls back. The girls, all you have to do, girls, send a picture, send a letter to Kennedy's Industrial. Hollywood, John Tatum will look at you, take a look at you, and maybe I'll bring you with me. <laughs> but the number one thing I'm here for it's not to show you my pretty girls, but it's to beat everybody up in the USWA. And I'm going to show you that right now, Percy. Come on, girl. You heard him. Hollywood John Tatum is making his return to the world-famous Sportatorium. He needs no introduction. We know him very, very well. The toast of the coast himself. The Hollywood man with all of his beautiful ladies getting into the ring. Six, six beautiful young ladies surrounding the man from Hollywood, California. His opponent is now stepping in through the rope. With, with the white mask, you have the wrestling pro, the wrestling pro under the white mask. Look at Hollywood John Tatum standing there with all of his women surrounding him. I do have to say one thing, he uh, certainly keeps good company. Look at the masked man waiting patiently in his corner. He's giving each one of them a kiss. He's wiggling out of that beautiful robe. Hollywood Tatum's always been known for his flamboyant robes that he wears into the ring. And this has been known for the valets in the past, some of the most big name valets in the wrestling sport. Missy Hyatt, Sunshine. They've all seen John Tatum before. Now here's six beautiful ladies standing here at ringside as Mr. Tatum prepares to go to work. The wrestling pro steps in, locks up with the Hollywood man. Whoa! Whips right around, locks that arm up. Uh-oh, the pro reverses it, backs him into the ropes. He backs off. He has his own little cheerleading section over here. Oh, look at this, the pro got him with a body slam. That was a surprise, but the Hollywood man came right up and caught him with a hard right. And down to the canvas, the professional went. Boy, his cheerleaders are over here just like the cowboy cheerleaders. They're all clapping and just uh, egging him on. Whoa, suplex, hard suplex. Brings the wrestling pro down to the canvas. He grabs the mask, grabs the leg, going for a pin. <laughs> he snatches him up. Tatum decides that uh, it wasn't enough. He's going to give him a little bit more. Into the ropes goes the professional. Oh, my. What a powerful close line. Wow. Tatum certainly has a reputation, like I said before. Everybody knows the man from Hollywood. We'll never forget Missy Hyatt. We'll never forget the long-standing feud involving Hollywood John Tatum, and now he's back, challenging that USWA open-door policy. What a kick! Don't tell me, don't tell me he thinks he's another Tojo Yamamoto or something. I sure hope not. He's covered the professional for the pin. He got it. A count of three. Hollywood John Tatum.
there's your winner. Being congratulated by all of these lovely cheerleaders here at ringside at the world famous Porter Toyon. Right now we're going to take time out and we're going to look at a special video special on Chris Champion. Let's look at that. Now we're going to take a shot.